Hello, I am Dr. William Myron, Principal of Milburn High School. And I am Bob Keenan, Vice Principal of Milburn High School. And we are excited to share some information with you about the proposed creation of innovation research and design spaces. They are included in the upcoming Investing in Excellence referendum. These innovative spaces are large, open and flexible spaces that provide students with the resources and materials necessary to engage in research, design, and creation related for both school and personal learning projects. Innovation describes the ways in which we want to help our students learn, to engage with content, resources, and each other in order to enhance the process of thinking, engaging, and testing involved with generating new ideas and applying knowledge in meaningful ways. Our innovative spaces will help our students learn to use failure as a learning opportunity to help strengthen their knowledge, understanding, and stamina. We believe that these qualities help make our students more attractive to colleges and provide them with the types of skills that will help them prepare for the 21st century workplace. To succeed in university and workplace life, students must be able to think critically and problem solve, collaborate, possess the agility to adapt, value entrepreneurship, be able to access and analyze information effectively, communicate orally and in writing, and show curiosity and imagination. Whether arts and humanities or STEM-oriented, innovative spaces provide an environment for all our students where interdisciplinary and cross-curricular work and thinking can live and where the application of new learning can play out. With the successful referendum, Deerfield and South Mountain Elementary Schools will be able to further enhance their current innovative spaces through the acquisition of a 3D printer, additional storage, shelving for projects, supplies, tools, and design challenge resources. Harshorn, Glenwood, and Wyoming Elementary Schools will look to recreate their innovative spaces through installation of tile, lab tables, collaborative tables, and chairs. They will also receive a 3D printer, storage, shelving, and projects, supplies, tools, and design challenge resources. At the middle school, we will convert the multi-purpose room into innovative, collaborative space. We will then add a new multi-use space that will be better equipped for physical education classes and large group meetings. At the high school, we will convert the media center into the innovative, collaborative space that will support robotics, computer science, the digital video courses, storage in a multidisciplinary projects area. We will then add a new media center space. It is important for us to create a common understanding that there is no separate innovative design and research curriculum. To develop one would contradict the integrated and interdisciplinary goals of the work. The space will necessitate the enhancement of curriculum. However, there are certain courses that may be permanently housed in a new space. At the middle school, these include robotics, critical thinking, and the new design challenge course. While at the high school, these include robotics, architecture, and television production. Earlier in the year, the assistant superintendents gave a presentation to the general public entitled Milburn Innovates, the vision to be realized. That presentation can be found on the district's homepage via the referendum link. Thank you for listening. Please familiarize yourselves with a wealth of referendum information on our district website and cast an informed vote on September 27th.